We're checking in with Kara one more time at Northcutt Elementary, where the 8th Annual Georgia United Credit Union School Crashers event recently took place. Now listen, if you are a UGA fan, check out who else was lending a helping hand. Coach Smart, thanks so much for being here. Um, let's jump right in. Why uh, was it important for you to be involved with School Crashers? Well, it's about education and it's about service. Uh, we have a purpose in life and uh, to give back is so important. And what Georgia United Credit Union has been able to do and their foundation has been able to do with all the sponsors, it's just been incredible. And uh, when you think about the most base element you have as a human being or a, a coach is to give back to the community. Yeah. yeah. Talk a little bit about um, your personal connection. I heard you speak earlier on it, and I think it's so important for people to know that, you know, tugs on your heartstrings a little bit to be here. Well, anything to do with education is tugs on my heartstrings. Both parents been educators. Georgia State retired. Uh, my mother-in-law, um, she's given so much back to this community, 34 years here in Clayton County. It just it means a lot when you give back, and the people here are giving back. And it wouldn't be possible if you didn't have the volunteers that are here today, um, the Georgia United Credit Union staff, with the unbelievable, unbelievable leadership of Debbie, it's just incredible and it's so important that we do it. Yeah, talk a little bit about why UGA Athletics chose um, Georgia United as their official credit union. Well, it's number one, their leadership. You know, when you when every event I've been to involved in Georgia United Credit Union has been incredible. They've got great leadership. Um, they're great servers of our community because who you partner with is kind of your brand and who you represent. So these guys do an incredible job uh, representing the G, and we want to do the same for them in return. Uh, did you, okay, sidebar question. My husband reads a lot of books on being a leader. Do you think you were born with it? Or did you, like, how do you think you became such a great leader? Because you're surrounded by so many leaders here today, people in the community doing so much. Is it something you can learn or you think you're just kind of born with it? Well, absolutely, yeah. you, you can learn it. I mean, it's it's one of those, it's the people that you're led by, mm -hmm. and you lead by example, and you learn from the le the leaders that you've been influenced by. And I've been fortunate to be around some really good educators, really good leaders, really good coaches, and they shape who you are. Mm -hmm. And uh, we're always getting shaped by young and old people. Yeah. What are you doing here today, specifically with school crashers? biggest thing is being able to give back and thank the, the volunteers that are here. I mean, they're giving their time, their energy, and their effort. Um, Georgia United Credit Union, their foundation is giving their time and effort to an unbelievable cause. You know, to, to give over a million dollars since they started this program. It's a nation, nationally recognized program, and they've done it so well. And uh, over eight spots this year they picked to give to, and just means so much when you give back. And uh, Northcutt's very blessed to have this. Yeah, I'm sure it's such an important part of your job every year. Um, I told everyone that I was getting to talk to you, and you're kind of a big deal. Oh, uh, <laughs> you know that. I'm sure you're very humble too. But most people wanted to know what you do when you're not working. What does Kirby Smart do to relax? Well, I, I like to give back time. I spend a lot of time with my kids. My family is so important to me, and we spent this summer with a daughter playing basketball, a son playing tennis, and another son playing baseball. So I spend a lot of my time around those guys with uh, my wife and our kids. Nice. Wait, okay, so we have a son who plays baseball. I do too. Yeah. It's exhausting, isn't it? It's exhausting. It? Oh Travel God. ball, all star. Travel ball? Never stops. Oh, it, it never, ever stops. But um, it's fun. Yeah, I like that they're all involved um, in something that you can hang out with them that way. It's been, we always said we weren't going to live through our kids, but you know what? That's what we we're do. doing. No doubt. <laughs> That's what we're doing. That's right. Well, thank you so much for being here. We so appreciate you being here and for volunteering and for all the good work you do on and off the field. Thank you for covering this event. Yeah, of course. I'm going to send it back to you, Christine. We've been so blessed to be here. 11 Alive is so proud to partner with School Crashers and Georgia United Credit Union. And um, yeah, we hope to be back next year. But this year, it just feels a little bit sweeter for some reason. All right, back to you. It sure does. Thank you, Kara. Thank you, Coach. And guys, thank you for tuning in. We so appreciate it. We'll see you back here tomorrow.